Hey folks, I know some of you have already been ice fishing, but here in southeast Pennsylvania, not quite yet, but it's coming. Anyway, in order to get all my stuff ready, I needed some live bait. I checked out four or five different places where you could get live bait through the mail, off the internet, and I'm going to show you all of them, show you what they cost, and I'm going to show you where you can get the best deal. So here we go. I did take a few notes here so I don't make any mistakes because I wouldn't want to do that. But there's a there's a lot of places on the internet you can buy live bait and depending on where you live you can you know do your searching from there. Here in southeast Pennsylvania I figured I'd look out as far as Minnesota. There's a few places in Ohio um, and places that you know aren't all that far away really. So one of the places I went was uh, Blue Ribbon Blue Ribbon Bait, I guess it's called. It's in Oakdale, Minnesota. Nah, you know. Um, so I'm shopping for 250 waxworms. Now, if you're looking for mousies or mealies or, or uh, things like that, you can get them too. But I'm specifically looking for 250 waxworms. Blue Ribbon will uh, charge me $10.95. And again, they're in Minnesota, so to ship it here in southeast Pennsylvania, they would charge me eight dollars and twenty-eight cents. Not too bad. Now, if you do buy seventy-five dollars worth of stuff from them or more, they'll ship it for free, which is, you know, obviously a uh, a good deal too. Let's look at the next place. Then I went to uh, a place called Speedy Worm. They specialize in fresh live bait. It says. They're in Alexandria, Minnesota. They'll do 250 waxworms uh, for $11. They'll ship it UPS, no, no, USPS, that's the United States Postal Office, for uh, $10.43. They didn't indicate how much that weighed, but uh, whatever. Now they will give you a crush proof box if you want to pay four dollars more. So I don't know why the, the box they ship it in isn't good enough, but there you go. Okay, let's go to the next place. Uh, let's see here. Knudsen's Live Bait. I've heard of them. A lot of you probably have heard of them. Maybe you've heard of the other ones I'm going to be talking about. But Knudsen's is uh, out in Brooklyn, Michigan. And for 250 waxworms, they will charge me $12.99. However, they're going to ship it UPS ground, and it's based on the package weighing two pounds. Uh, I think they overestimated the weight, but because of that, they're going to ship it to me for $19.07. Keep in mind, they're in Michigan. I'm in southeast Pennsylvania. So I, you know, I checked on that a little bit. Based on the UPS rates from them to me, I'm in zone four. It should only be $12.18, but they're going to charge me $19.07 because they say it weighs two pounds. I don't think so, but I'll show you why later. There's no option for priority mail, but if there was, they could ship it to me for $10.10 priority .10 mail. Now those, now they will also give you free shipping if you order $75 worth or, or more. But that two pounds is a bit overestimated. I'm going to, again, I'm going to show you that in just a couple minutes why I think so. Next place. Let's go to, I think this is a well-known spot here. This is Grubco. I know a lot of people are familiar with that, but let's look at them. They're in Fairfield, Ohio. They'll give me 250 waxworms for $10. But the kick in the pants here is they're going to, they have a flat rate shipping of $19.95. Now, this is probably no matter where you live, could be just based on where I'm at, but 
It says all orders will now be shipped with a flat rate of $19.95 per order. Now they do mention that that is shipped UPS next day air. So if you want them really quick, this, this guy will get them to you next day, but it's going to cost you a few bucks. That's Grubco. Now, final spot. I've been buying my live bait for the last three or four years from Best Bait. Best Bait, I think, at least for me, has the best deal. You can figure it out for yourself. Best Bait is in Marblehead, Ohio. They're they're on a peninsula that sticks out into the uh, west end of Lake Erie a little bit. It's a great place for a, a bait company. Thirteen dollars and ninety-nine cents for 250 wax horns. That's a little higher than everybody else, but free shipping. UPS ground, free shipping. It'll take about five days, and I just got mine in uh, five days. However, they do give you an option. They'll ship it priority mail, and you can get it probably in three days, depending on where you live, for $4. So that is what I think is the best deal at least for me, but before you buy your live bait, you should check out a few spots like I did. Now, let's get back to the weight of this thing. I got a scale here, and this is Best Bait's box that they shipped me the wax worms in. And with the wax worms in there and all the packing, I put it on my scale, which I use all the time for post office, and it almost weighs eight ounces. You can't tell me that it weighs two pounds. So best bait is fair with the shipping, that's for darn sure. And uh, and again, the one that's overestimating that a little bit, <laughs> Knutsen's, they say it weighs two pounds. I don't know what the heck they're shipping it in. Maybe they're putting some lead in the bottom of it. But these wax worms that I've been getting from Best Bait are absolutely perfect. Comes in a box like that with the packing. Now I've already opened this because I've been taking care of them for a couple of days and I'll show you how to do that in a minute. So let's open this up and take a look at these wax worms. This is 250 wax worms and I mean they are ready to go. They pack them in sawdust. Now the way to take care of these, you don't want to put them, you don't want to freeze them and you don't want to keep them too warm. I keep them down in my basement where it's uh, about 52 degrees. However, I keep them down on the floor where it's about 2 or 3 degrees cooler. So that makes it like, you know, 48, 52 degrees perfect for keeping wax worms alive. The only thing you don't want to do, the only thing you want to do, <laughs> every day or every two days, open this up, spread them out on a table or whatever you got. You got to pick out, the, you're going to find some dead ones. Every once in a while you'll find three or four dead ones. But you got to do it every, every couple days. You pick out the dead ones, they'll be black, they're easy to see. Get rid of them, you don't want the dead ones sitting in there. Or any of them that have already started to make a cocoon and you'll see that it's like a little lump of sawdust you want to get rid of that too other than that that's all you got to do now for me this 250 will last me all season because we don't get a lot of ice here in southeast Pennsylvania so uh, um, you know I use them up but it's good they're gonna last me six to eight weeks no problem if I if I take care of them the way I just told you so shop around for your best deal grab them wherever you see them Take care of them right, and you'll have good bait for the whole year. So for right now, I'm going to uh, say goodbye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share the video, like the video, and hit the subscribe button button that is somewhere around <laughs> on the video when you watch it. See you later.